love fetish photography and love pornography to a certain degree. Um, for for this body of work, I mean, it, it's not a secret that Japan is so sexually charged. The woman is our muse and, and, and our vehicle of expression. We do have a love for fashion and glamour and makeup and hair and styling. And I think that still comes out in our personal work, but, but perhaps the message is much deeper than the superficial fashion ad in the magazine. We pull from a reservoir of dreams, our imagination, our desires. And I have a background in street photography. I have a background in the Henri Cartier Bresson's decisive moment. And in a lot of ways, I think that comes across in these staged, constructed uh, situations. The outsider has this idea of what Japan is in their heads. And I would say maybe 50% of that is a fantasy idea in their head. It's so steep in tradition, but at the same time, it's where all technology is coming out of nowadays. It's such a mysterious place. We thrive on that, catching that moment where it can go so many different directions in a narrative.